Hoodlums in their numbers attacked Nigeria Labor Congress protests over the mass sacking of workers in Kaduna State. The Labor declared a five-day warning strike on what they term an injustice to workers in the state. Addressing journalists after the attack, the NLC president, Ayuba Waba, says they had earlier alerted the IGP and other security agencies. Be responsible for what will happen here, even though I can't drop my life for here. But let the governor be aware that this is no politics. We are following our due rights, we are following due process. This thing that we are doing is, is legal, not illegal. Anything that happened here, the governor should be held responsible. Probably to know that everybody is no is not no abiding citizen, he's not respecting the constitutional right of Nigerian workers, he's an enemy of Nigerian workers. Let me tell you, as far as I'm concerned, the whole public knows that we, judiciary staff, we are on strike. This is almost about two months. We will never call up the strike until he shows us that he's no abiding citizen and he respects the laws of the constitution of Nigeria. That's on section 81, subsection 3, 121, subsection 3, 162, subsection 3, and believe the suppression of power and believe the workforce and allow the NLC to be as their own. Yes. They were escorted. Yes, sir. We saw the governor leading them. Yes, sir. And we saw before the attack. Yes, sir. Whereas he passed here, nobody said they want to him. Yes, but he led them to come and attack us. Yes, sir. The Lord must see. Yes, sir. The Lord must hear it. Yes, sir. We are in a democracy. We are not in a military team. Yes. Right to protest under the law. is to activate yes. the decision of what they said yes. that if this peaceful protest fails, yes. we should then activate a national protest yes. that will be activated yes. we will consult our necessary organs yes. and that will be activated yes. once again solidarity but we are going to make these people available both including going to court when the need arises because he must pay for this damage we cannot leave him alone because in the morning the information came that the ROFI has planned perfected plan to attack us with hoodlums. The names we are mentioned and where they are coming from, where they will be giving money and all the rest. That clip went viral this morning and the NSC president communicated to security agency of that information. All of a sudden, all of a sudden, that same information that was given to police to prevent and prehend. They could not apprehend it. The people came live. Rather than the police facing the hoodlums, the fire tear gas on the innocent people. But that does not deter us. Like I told you, we are resolute to Tomorrow they are going to see more than this number and we are going to change strategy. Aero Fire will have it hot here in Kaduna and we are willing to do so. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.